Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Aqua's Adventure. Today we are playing on the new 1.12 snapshot update thing. So of course with this comes all the concrete and terracotta. So we're going to be playing around looking at some of the things, maybe going to get some parrots. But already from the beginning, uh, this is one of the new things. It's like a new crafting thing, I guess. So that's interesting. Uh, let's try to make some concrete powder. I heard this is a thing. So hopefully, <clears throat> I get it right. But I don't know if there's a specific shape to it. Something like this, right? Yes, con blue concrete powder. Okay, I just made a lot of it. So I, I still don't get how this thing works. Let's show only the craftable. See, I don't don't know exactly how that works but okay so we got the concrete powder now I'm pretty sure this stuff turns into concrete once it touches water right okay chest get out of my way so let's just like go over here uh, I don't want to mess up my torches uh, let's go over here yeah I placed all these torches down I don't feel like demolishing them you know what? we can actually go right over here okay so if I place this Bam, it just turns into concrete, just like that. And now we got a concrete block, a blue concrete. New recipes unlocked. What do you mean new recipes unlocked? Okay. And I guess this will just keep growing as we go, I guess. And it's giving me suggestions on what to do, because this is the first time I've actually opened up this game with this new update. So, of course, these little pop-ups are always going to happen. But, okay. That is... A fence gone right there. I wonder why this is missing. I should and right there. Hmm. Some of my fences are disappearing and right there. I should probably replace those. But cool. So those are the new concrete blocks. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna stick all this in here because I don't need any of it. Now, there's the new terracotta. So what used to be hardened clay is just now the terracotta if i'm right right orange terracotta yeah and this stuff is kind of just the same but if you smelt it it turns into the glazed terracotta i'm pretty sure so let's stick that in there give it a moment and yeah guys so a couple of the plans for the future of this world a lot of things down here are not done so I have, I have some big plans like obviously the potion farm was broken in one of the updates so we're gonna have to somehow remake the potion farm I have no idea how we'll look up a YouTube tutorial see what's up but I am planning on making a new potion farm soon uh, I'm still I'm still kinda working on the whole plant thing I wanna make kinda like a plant museum down here with like every single plant and stuff and then obviously we finished the squid farm an episode or two ago and a little update on it it works well, I know this might not seem like a lot, but considering I haven't, I, I've probably been on five minutes in like the past like three months. There are about ten double chests there with four stacks each. That's that's more than an entire double chest full of ink sacks. So that is pretty good. All right, but let's go ahead and check up on the glazed terracotta. Take a look at it. Glass. Oh, come on, game. Not in this one either, not in this one either. Oh, geez. Okay, orange glazed terracotta. So I'll just leave the rest of it to smell. So yeah, each color has like a special pattern to it. Which is kind of cool. So you know what we're going to do? And by the way, this episode is going to be mostly focused on the new update and not actually kind of doing stuff, which hopefully you guys don't mind too much. Let's just grab a bunch of this terracotta and let's kind of see what each of them transforms into i kind of already know but i want to see them for myself kind of in game because i haven't played with them other than the snapshot to record the video i have not played with them at all so let's go ahead and just stick all of these in the furnaces okay so at least one or two of each kind should be cooked by now so let's just grab all of them kind of take them outside and you can kind of just take a look at them. I'll tell you guys which one's my favorite and stuff. And of course, I mess up <laughs> that stupid jump pad almost every single time. Okay, so let's kind of take a look. <clears throat> this one, 
This one's not that bad. I can see a little creeper face. That one's craft wooden planks, but I, but I don't know. I don't want to. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me get. Oh, okay. It just goes away. Cool. Um, so this one, not that bad. I like that one. Uh, this one kind of looks cool. Not, not too good. I love this one for sure. This green one. Um, I usually don't like super bright things. But in this case, this one's kind of interesting. I do like this. This one I don't really like. Kind of looks like, I don't even know. It just makes me think of like eggs. And then just like spoiled eggs because there's blue. I don't know. That one's weird. This one, this one's not that bad either. I kind of like that one. The orange one I don't like. I think this one's disgusting. Nah, I don't, I don't. Like. Orange and blue does not go together very well. Now here are probably th two of my favorites. This one, this one, I really love this one. I really love this one. And this one's, yeah, this one's okay. Yeah. I mean, you could probably kind of see a sense. I'm really liking the white and blue ones. Like, these two I love. I love this one. The green, I do like. The black one, and then this one I love. A lot of the more orange-yellow ones, I'm not too big of a fan of. But, yeah, those are the colors. Those are pretty cool. So, guys, I think what we should do next is go get the parrots. Now, they're in the jungle, I'm pretty sure, and I have no idea how I'm going to bring them here. And um, they can fly, and they follow you, right? So I might fly over with my Elytra, and then just kind of fly back, and then they should come with me, right? Okay, guys, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to grab two extra pairs of Elytra. I'm going to grab a whole ton of fireworks. Got to make sure I don't run out. And then, of course, some seeds. So originally, parrots were tameable with cookies, and then the people found out that cookies are actually very bad for parrots, and the devs changed it to seeds, which is a pretty good idea. Don't want some kids feeding their parrots cookies. Anyway, so we need to go to 3,400. So yeah, I think that is this way now. Okay, so... Okay, cool. So we need to head in this direction very, very far. So yeah, I'll meet you guys at 3000. And there is the jungle. Okay, cool. Now let's see if do parrots are, are do parrots just chill? Where are they? Okay, so I guess we can just kind of like whoop on top of a tree. There we go. Oh, no, I fell. Okay, I guess we can just swoop over here. Okay, cool. Now, how do parrots spawn? Do they only spawn in the day? Should have probably Googled this. All right, so what I got from the wiki page is, yeah, they just naturally spawn in the jungle. So I guess I'll wait here until I see one. Okay, well, while we're here looking for parrots, I did just find a jungle temple thing. All right, well, while we're here, might as well have a little bit of fun, right? So, I guess we can just go traditional style, just kind of walk in here. I actually, like, haven't been in one of these in quite a while. Let's go on the behind. There's nothing here, so it all must be downstairs. Like, I haven't been in one of these in forever. At least not one that I just kind of, like, ran through. Okay. Let's take this as, like, a real puzzle. Do I have any torches on me? Ooh, night vision. How lucky is that? Let's let's drink this boy real quick. Okay, let's kind of go through it. Now, I know there's, like, traps. There's, like, yeah, that stuff. Ouch. Ooh. <laughs> so hidden. Okay. And then there's redstone. Oh, we must have uncovered it. Ow. <laughs> and there's literally nothing in here. It's cool, though. <laughs> I love these things. Okay, here. Let's just... What's in here? Honestly, the only thing valuable to me are, like, the dispensers, pretty much. I'll just break this boy open. Alright, is there anything good in here? Oh. Oh. There's a piston. What's in here? Ooh, diamonds, emeralds. Okay, I'll take these. Uh, I'll just drop these, and... There's only, like, 50 in there. There we go. Bam. Actually, I don't need that want that sticky piston though. I mean, fireworks are cheap, right? 
Yeah, so I guess we'll just get rid of those. And yeah, we're gonna take. We're gonna definitely take these pistons. Pistons are very, very nice. Okay, cool. Anyway, we came here for parrots. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, so I don't know if I'm just getting super unlucky or they don't spawn in pre 1.12 jungles. But I guess I'm just gonna go find another jungle that hasn't been rendered in before this point and see if they spawn there because yeah I'm not having much luck in this one alright here is a new jungle about 3,000 blocks away this one has never been rendered in to my best of knowledge let's see if we can find any parrots in this one huh what did I just hear I heard a chirp. Where are you? I heard you. <laughs> oh my god, I've been looking forever. Where are you? Oh my god, he's... No! Where'd you go? I just saw you. Okay, they're alive. They are alive. I know this. Now the real question is, it's green. And then blend it in. Okay, let's try to get to it. Huh. Missed. Okay, and yeah, we can break these. Love me, please. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Alright, let's see. Now, this is a real... Will he just follow me? If I fly over here... Will he magically follow? Ah, there you are, buddy. Okay, cool. That is so cool. They finally added. This is the first flying thing in Minecraft, like animal wise. So that's. Where'd you go? Alright, anyway. I guess. Let's keep looking. So I guess my maybe problem was I kept flying around. Maybe I should have actually just walked. But yeah. And there is another jungle temple here. So you know I'm gonna rob it. So let's jump in here. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna take the board. The bo the boring route. I'm just gonna break into this bad boy. Just give me your loot. Bam. Ooh, diamond horse armor. It's good. And then I don't need that ore. Not now. Ow. Now here's the thing. I gotta make sure my parrot doesn't die. So I'm gonna take these. And then there's like nothing cool in there. Alright, so yeah, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to stop flying, because maybe that's why they're not spawning. Maybe I need to walk around instead. What's up, dude? So, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to chill on my feet. There's another parrot. Oh my god. It took forever. No, come here. Oh, there's two parrots. Love me. Alright, there is one. Come here and love me. Bam, there's three. Okay, now are they all cool? Here, this one needs to stand up. Get that one, are you standing up? Nope, okay, he's standing up. Okay, so let's fly. Or just, I need them to come over here. Ah, uh, we got three now? Okay, so now how do these things breed? Do they, do they not breed? Okay, so parrots can not be bred. So unlike all the other pets if they die it's pretty much rip so I should maybe grab a couple while I'm here alright you know what guys I think I think for now three parrots will be enough with our three parrots now where did the green one go did I accidentally make a sit down somewhere oh there he is he's just in the sky chilling Okay, so let's bring him inside the house, and we can kind of play with them a little bit. Okay, so one cool feature about them is they actually can stand on your shoulder. So if you I think if you walk through them, I know they jump off if you just kind of jump. How do you get them on again? Okay, you must have to walk through them while they're flying, but yeah, you can stand on your shoulder. So let's let's get this guy up. Yeah, and there we go. You have two. <laughs> and then you just jump to get them off. So that's kind of cool. And then another interaction 
is they actually dance when you have a jukebox. Now, uh, do I? I know I have some CDs, right? I guess we could just use this one for now. Another thing that we got to do in the future is CDs. I guess for now, uh, where can I just place some stuff? I guess we'll just place them here. It's kind of interesting and lucky. So, bam, let's make two, because why not? And then, do we still have the CD? Oh, we must have placed it in here by accident. Okay, so let's place this down. And yeah, they do like a little dance thingy. Which is, uh, kind of interesting. Let's move this guy a little bit closer so he can start dancing. Come on, dance, little guy. I guess we might have to reset it. Bam, yeah, now all three are dancing. Okay, cool. So, yeah, that's interesting. And we'll get more CDs later on. It's another little project I have going. But, yeah, those are parrots for you. Uh, another thing about them is, I think I said earlier, if you feed them cookies, they will die. Which I'm not going to because I don't have many parrots. So, <laughs> I'm going to leave them be. Now, guys, like I said, today I kind of wanted to focus on the update. And that was pretty much the update. In later episodes, we will build stuff with the glazed terracotta and the concrete. But I do want to show you guys something before we do leave that's kind of interesting. So, one of the things that I've always kind of like just wanted to do for no apparent reason is building my own house in Minecraft. Just kind of for fun. So, over there, yes, that is my house in Minecraft. So, I kind of just did it for fun. I didn't do it on camera. I just felt like building one day. So, I'll kind of, I could give you a little, I could give you guys a house tour in Minecraft. But yeah, um... So my house is a little bit weird. It's like the bottom portion's brick, and then the top is wood because it was built in different time periods. Now I don't think it the the it doesn't look like this. I'm pretty sure it's just weird. I I don't know how to explain it. I probably got it wrong, but yeah, just the house. Just know the top. The, my house has two floors. The top and bottom levels were built at different times. This is kind of my front yard here. We have like a little porch thingy now. Uh, we have usually four cars. There's usually one here. So that's my car right there, my brother's car, my mom's van, and then my dad usually has his truck right on the other side of the street. So right here we have a little garage, and then, we, of course, we have a little backyard that we can gotta go through here. A little basketball thingy over here. We got a trampoline, a little shed. We got back here, we got some, like, wood for bonfires. We usually got, like, a bunch of old broken bicycles around here, which I can't really do. And then we have like a little, little, little garden with flowers over here and a bonfire pit and like a little table. I, obviously, I could add more detail, but I, at the same time, since it is kind of just like a random project, I did get lazy. And there is a door from the back here. And yeah, let's, I guess, start from the front. But yeah, it's just kind of something I had a little bit of fun with. And I guess I'll just slowly add details as we go. This is like minimal detail right now. Yeah, we can jump up here, and this carpet is actually green here, which is interesting. This is our front door. We got a little living room. We got a TV back there, a little fireplace that doesn't actually work, which brings us to this hallway. And then from this hallway, we got stairs right here to go upstairs. And if we go here, this is the kitchen, and then this is the living room. We have our fridge in the living room. That is quite weird, but that's where it is. And over here is the basement. But actually, over here is where uh, where my room is which i'll show you guys in a second but quickly i'll just show you this is upstairs we got one room over here one room over here this was these two rooms were actually connected which you'll see like over there but we actually put a drywall here a while ago this is the bathroom but yeah so, and then this is a room over here this is how that room originally looked but of course we split it up like i said but if we go over here in this little hallway my brother's room is right here bathroom and then this is actually my room right here so if we're talking about where i'm recording i'm at this moment <laughs> standing in this chair right here facing this screen recording my little webcams right here this is where i at where i am in real life in this exact position yeah so this is my room just kind of fun so yeah i don't know why i built that but i'll slowly add details as we go and then who knows maybe in a couple episodes i'll 
update you guys but yeah, everybody today was fun we got a look at some of the new parrots which we will build a home for later some of the little plan i looked at some of the new blocks so sorry to, today was kind of a little short and we didn't actually do much but i hope you guys enjoyed it anyway guys if you did enjoy make sure you like a comment as a support on the channel and i'll see you guys later god bless and goodbye